Hi, we welcome you back to the Advanced Movement Disorder video series. In this video, we are going to discuss about tremors. So, Dr. Srinivas, can you explain to us what are tremors? A tremor is a symptom. It's not a disease. A tremor means an, a movement of any part of the body. We call it as a rhythmical movement. Basically, there should be a to and fro movement. It can affect any part of the body. Commonly, we see it in the hands. Can affect your voice, can affect your head, it can affect your legs. So, and depending on the part of the body affected, we give different names to it. This is jaw tremor, orthostatic tremor, leg tremors, hand tremors, or head tremors. So, Dr. Srinivas, are all tremors abnormal or can tremors be normal? We divide tremors into physiological, that is, normally occurring tremors. Our body in itself can cause mild oscillations, which can sometimes become more apparent, especially when somebody is anxious, somebody is not having enough sleep, somebody is very hungry, or when your blood sugar is low. People can have some tremors which can come out. You might have noticed it when you're having a big exam or a big interview, your hands start to shake a little bit. These are physiological tremors. However, what we are more concerned about is what we call pathological tremors, where the tremors are so significant that they affect your activities of daily living. They can affect a, lo a lot of things such as ability to write properly and ability to sign your name. They can also have difficulty feeding themselves using a spoon or a fork and they tend to spill a lot when they're drinking from a glass. So are all abnormal tremors due to Parkinsonism or could there be other causes? As I said, tremor is a symptom. There are many causes of this. Parkinson is the most commonly known uh, cause of tremors. However, there are lot of medical conditions can cause tremors, a lot of neurological illnesses can cause tremors. You can have tremors following a stroke, you can have it for following multiple sclerosis, you can have it in people who are having alcohol withdrawal, you can also have it in people who have severe nerve damage. There are also other causes such as increased thyroid activity, low blood sugar, uh, low calcium and other conditions. You need to do a specific targeted tests to look at the cause of a tremor to understand what is happening. So if any of your friends, colleagues are suffering from tremors, please visit our Advanced Movement Disorder Clinic. Thank you.